In this week's episode, I head back out west to Glenline Dam to see if I can find a big Murray cod with my name on it. There's plenty of thrills and spills along the way, and maybe even a trophy fish or two. So strap yourself in and enjoy the adventure. G'day guys and welcome to another Sammy Hitsky fishing adventure. This is the revenge edition. I'm back at Glenline Dam and I'm here to catch a cod. As you would have seen last week, got absolutely skunked. Um, so I'm back with a plan of attack to catch my own big one. Doesn't have to be a meter. It would be nice, but just anything green, I reckon it'll be a big win. Now last time I was here with two experts, Colby and Lubin, and they are obviously epic cod fishermen as you would have seen. But this time I've got a whole different plan of attack. I've gone with someone with absolutely no knowledge on cod fishing at all. It's the great Sean Whale. There we go and say, what an intro, mate. <laughs> I'd just like to say that what I don't know about cod I make up for with a complete understanding of women. Actually, two things I lack a lot of knowledge on. But I'd like to catch my first cod, that'd be a nice thing. Well, I'm going to come up here because that's going to be backlit as all hell. But look, we've got the tinny. We've got a cracker flat here, we've got swim baits, we've got a positive attitude again. We've got some port, we've got some good weather, um, we've got the sun in our eyes. And what do you reckon, we're gonna catch cod? I hope so, look, I don't know much about cod, I just love to see one. That's that's my goal for the next couple of days. If I can see a cod, I'll be stoked. Well, I reckon they're epic fish. I'm hoping not only can I see one, I can hold one. Um, whether Sean gets to do that or not, don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Don't care, nah. I'll be stoked with the yellow belly gear, yeah, to be honest. We've, we've bought the yellow belly gear. We're going to have a crack at that too. Um, we talked to the guys at Caravan Park. Apparently has been a bit slow the last couple of days. So that may work in or against, in our favour or against us. Don't know. All we know is going to give it a red hot crap. <laughs> a red hot crack? <laughs> you know, who knows? Who knows? We might give a crap, but we'll give it a red hot crack and um, get some lures in the water and... Hopefully, turn one of these big green monsters up ourselves. So Give us a. You usually have some little pearler of wisdom at the start of the videos. Oh, look, I'm going to be a little bit quiet today. I just finished a bucks party, so I'm um, a little bit wounded at the moment. But I'm just stoked to be out here. This is I've done about three or four sessions on freshwater, so I really don't know a lot about freshwater fishing. But I'm very keen to give this a crack because this could be. I don't know, I think I could get into this, it's pretty cool. So anyway. Could be one of those things. You've got two people with a quarter of an idea, but together we have half an idea. So <laughs> that's got to account for something. We're going to get casting. We're uh, coming up to our first Arvo session. Um, mate, let's do it. All right. Do we Mighty Ducks it? What's that? Quack. Quack. Let's go cast Quack. this way if I can. <clears throat> oh, rules at play. So. I've decided on the drive up, long lonely drive up, that um, if you break your PB cod, you have to go for a swim. That'd be hard. <laughs> or if you catch a donut, you've got to go for a swim. So the water is, hang on, let's just check the sounder for the water temp. The water's 15 degrees. Oh, no way. So it's chilly. I'm not doing it. It is brisk. Um, so look, there's a fair chance you're just going to see two pale white. Um, Saltwater fish show is going for a swim at the end of this video, but uh, look, ladies watching, stay tuned for that. It's going to be great. <laughs> Two sloppy rigs in some frigid water. You're selling dreams, Sammy. <laughs> selling the dream. Right, guys, now we're going to go fishing. Now I have to make a bit of a small apology. Not apology, just a little public service announcement before the internet sees this and just runs with it. These are the same track pants that I wore <laughs> chasing Ludric. You remember from last time, uh, it's pretty easy to tell if they're a boy or not. This one's definitely a boy. That's uh, that's good. Now that's not that's not a Sammy stain. Must have really enjoyed catching Ludric. <laughs> oh, by the looks of things, I really <laughs> did enjoy catching Ludric. But that is a uh, Ludric male Ludric production. There, uh, turns out it stains um, the darker clothing. So look, that's that's what I'm dealing with. I only have a select few pairs of uh, track pants and uh, these ones did not make it back into the wash after that and um, look yeah just so you know that's what it is there's no there's no secrets here on the boat it's just a bit of um, 
reproductive juice from a ludric <laughs> on my pants. I don't think it's too much. There's nothing to laugh about. It's just it happens. It's a fact of life. Yeah, nature. Nature. But it's better than and one over here. Yeah. Michael Jordan's. <laughs> Michael Jordan's. I've got nearly every bit of clothing I own under here. There's some footy shorts on. Anyway. Oh, yeah, we get yeah. the picture. We get the picture. Let's go fishing. So first snag of the uh, trip, Sean. How are you, how are you finding it? I just wanted to feel what a bit of weight is like on the end of that, and uh, turns out exactly what you expected. Yeah, it's not as exciting as a cod. No, no, they they're not the snags. They um they don't go as hard. They don't have they do have the longevity of the fight though. They do. Thank you. Well, I'm gonna start my my campaign off with a swig. Swig. Yes. Really. Of Galloway. Last week was the first trip I've done without bit of port it's tradition that's why it didn't go down so well so we've got the uh, the Galloway pipe today guys age 12 years grand tawny with a hair hanging off it mm. Mm -hmm. mm. oh another snag straight up caramel another snag do you want to do you want to nibble yeah right I'll have to um, snag. as we bounce from snag to snag it's it's a great start. Snags are just everywhere, aren't they? Yeah. Look, I think that tree would be your where it progressed from. It's like way over there. Yeah, trees are big there. Oh. Breed them big up here. Right up. We're getting serious now. I'm ready. Port down. Right. Got a new setup, guys. New swim baiting outfit. Be nice to blood it. Just so you're aware of it, you're actually splashing it with your rod. And Every single time? Take it personally. <laughs> Every time? Most times. Like this is like a fair bit of water. Oh, it's not I'm hydrated. <laughs> I'm more hydrated than the pod. I guess one of us will have to move. I was just standing up. Oh, I wasn't suggesting it was going to be me. <laughs> With the sun on its way down, both the banter and casts were being fired out at a great rate of knots, but we hadn't had so much as a sniff from anything aquatic. Then, in the last fading shards of light, one cast was about to land in the perfect spot. Yeah. There's a net. Right. Oh. Don't have a shot at catching that one. Can you grab the net? Yep, 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 yep. Where is the net? Hey? Where is it? There it is. Oh, there he is, quick, quick. Oh, no, no. quick, quick. Oh, <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> oh, shit. Did it! Holy! Oh my goodness! Yeah, grab this, I can wind it in. Guys, um, that happened super, super, super fast. Um, he's only a little fella. Little? That's a. Oh, he's not a meter. He'd be an eighty or so. We just got a fish. Oh my we god! We just got a fish. That is so epic. Oh! oh. Holy! What just happened? Like, I almost didn't believe you when you oh, said you're on. My heart is going a, um, a, a lot of kilometres per hour. Oh. My goodness me. That's what, a, now what? That's yes. A, oh. That's a big we fish. We did it. That's a big fish, Whoa. eh? Right, good. You just come off that tree, halfway back to the tree. I just felt the... Out of nowhere. 
dude, that's that's big. It's big, like. <laughs> oh, I'm stoked. It's that's not trip. It's not tiny. Trip made. Oh, I can't believe that just happened. That is a beautiful fish. I wish there was a bit more light. I could see it. Well, we're about to make some light. Well, guys, I don't know what you can see. It's it's uh, you should be able to see a little bit. Mm. No, not really. Oh, you can kind of see. But, um, Arvo number one, A-team are bloody on. Got it. We are just lekking in out of the way here so we can kind of not kill the rest of our, our drift and um, and have a have a bit of a photo session and a look at this bad boy. Oh, that's That happened fast. That happened so fast, out of nowhere. And you got it in and, like, I didn't even get time. I couldn't wind what lure in or anything. I was just yelling at you for the net. Yeah. Let's have a little look at it, I reckon. And there it is. That's a... Pink muzzer. <laughs> that's a muzzer cod. Wow. That's what they look like. Oh, you ripper. That's a cracking cod. That is so cool. Oh, I'm going to catch one so bad. <laughs> Let's have a little look at him. <laughs> And that is revenge. Oh, don't roll on me, fella. Oh, like that. Oh, hooks out. Hooks out. <laughs> oh, you ripper. How good is that? How good is that? First afternoon. And we've ticked one off the board. Or, is that, does that make sense? Tick one off the board? Well, you can say whatever you want. Yeah. Just that. <laughs> that is so cool. So cool. Absolutely smack the swim bait. Just out of nowhere, we were talking, talking smack. And this guy come up and walloped it. If you just grab that net out of the way for a second, just give him a quick measure. Ah, oh, he's over. He's an 83. Cheeky 83. And I think I might grab a quick photo and get him back. There we go. <laughs> yes. Oh, I can't believe it happened that <laughs> so quick. That oh, so does that mean I just sit down and get drunk now, or you wanna? <laughs> I'm, I'm joining you. <laughs> was epic. Epic. Well, wouldn't say the action got any hotter after the uh, first fish it um if anything it got cooler along with the temperature it did get cold didn't it it is quite brisk that, oh, on. that's the current situation we've just had a lovely feed cooked up by master chef sean uh eye fillets a la Ooh, yeah. onion that and onion mushroom, mushroom. Ooh. yep there was a bag of salad put out yeah it remains it's unopened in the bag but uh, we ate yeah, some good steaks, that's, that's what we need for codfish tomorrow. And the Savo was just a prospecting. Now, I'm talking a big game now. If we go to the whole end of the trip and we don't get another hit, it's going to sound a lot worse. But we didn't actually have that high hopes for this afternoon. The Savo was just get out there, get a feel for it, get a lay of land, and tomorrow is absolute game time. Tomorrow is when the magic's going to happen. So. I hope so. I hope so. I want to get my first real cod. I've caught one once before, a little one about 40 centimetres. My mate Dylan, it was um that was really cool, cool to see one, but to see like an 80 centimetre fish today, those things are very special fish. Oh, oh I just want to get one so bad. I just want to get a meter in here. Oh, oh. I want to get a yellow belly too. Yeah. I know, no one really talks about those guys, but they are cool. Well, we got a bit of stuff to do tomorrow, then. Yeah, I want to get an, an 80 plus centimetre cod and a yellow belly. Yep, I'll do all the same again. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm happy, 280s is better than one. Yeah. Um, but yeah, look, we're going to call it a day pretty soon. So uh, we're going to get some beauty sleep, get up nice and early. It's going to be frosty, and uh, we're going to attack all guns blazing. Can't wait. So, look, it's been a good start of the trip. We need to keep on the momentum, keep the foot down, and go. That's my word of wisdom. I like it. Good morning team. It is very, very early and very, very cold. Um, 
yeah, it's proper cold this morning. Uh, but we're out. We're going to start casting early, see if we can get a nice dawn bite. Uh, get another one for the tally. Sean, how you going, mate? I'm good. I, I just would love to catch my first big cod. Sean, I pumped. I don't know if you can hear him in the mic. We're trying to be quiet because... Uh, because I assume cod don't like noise. Um, but yeah, we're going to start casting again. You're not going to see much until uh, until we light it up. If we get a hook up in the dark, you'll just hear some audio and then uh, it'll be lights on and hopefully fish on. So fingers crossed we can get connected to one this morning, uh, at least before our fingers fall off, because uh, that's a very real possibility at this minute. Wish us luck. Righto, guys. Not much has happened this morning. No nudges, but it's all about to change. Oh, on properly. Might be time. Might be time to christen the pole. Is it new? It is new. Bought for this occasion. But when you lose eight yellow spin bait. Well guys, it's pole time. I figured I'd need this after the brown dog incident of last trip. On. And that's why you get a lure pole. And then you can charge your mate 15 bucks per retrieve because it's cheaper than a lure. It's definitely a beer. It's definitely a cold beer. Did you? Did you bring a cold beer? There's, there's, a cold beer. there's one. I'd make a few on this so I get right. Oh, yeah. Got him. Get him out. Yes, Sean-o. You yes. got him. Yes. Yes. Why yes. oh, are you whispering? I don't know, but I'm excited. It's a good one too, man. It is a good one. Oh, yes. 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 sean the Yellow King. All right. How did it hit? Pretty good. He stopped that lure. Was that right next to the tree? Yeah. Is it in the tree? Yeah, pretty much. Do we need to net him or can yeah. we just grab him? No, it's four kilo line. I'll just grab him. Really? Yeah. I'll go I'll go to the comfort lift. Oh. Oh, one one hook just fell off. Okay, ready? I'm on the leader. Oh he's on you, on you. Just watch he doesn't run around the outboard. This is pretty much blue marlin fishing. Oh, I'm excited, mate. Oh, he has only got one hook point in him. Just using that. So big. This is my first yellow belly. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to cook it so hard for you. <laughs> They're pretty spiky, to be honest. Yeah, well, like the net would be good. Oh. <laughs> is this the, the point where we all go a little bit quiet? I touched the leader. How many times I say get the net? Yeah, you'll see a few. Yep. I was just going to grab it for you. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's alright. It's not as if it was the first and PB and all that sort of stuff at once, but oh, that's no. alright. That's alright, we didn't, didn't need to. Didn't need to get a photo oh, of it. I'm going to set up the net now so it's ready to go. Oh, I feel kind of bad. <laughs> I knew it. There's a disaster waiting to happen. <laughs> At least we, do we know what to do now. <laughs> now we know. No? Yeah, get the net. Get the <laughs> net. Well, you should have said something if you wanted oh, to net it. Oh, don't even. You should have said something. Make jokes tomorrow about this, please. <laughs> 
Ah, oh, frustrating. Yep. Really frustrating. There's a moment in every relationship. It's usually, you know, a bit of a bit of a hard time, and this could be ours. <laughs> Was... This may be the last video you ever see Sean in. Oh, that's a shame. That's a real shame. Yep. He was there for the taking. Oh, I was like, it was there. Like, like he had four or five guys that trying to grab him with your hands, let alone, like, that would have been real easy, just one scoop and he would have been in the boat. Could yeah, get, no. I could have got a photo of my first yellow belly. I thought you said you caught a yellow belly. I have, but they're not being big. That one wasn't massive. Well, still looks like that. Yeah, it's a good fish. <laughs> I've been happy with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stoked. Right, there's one over there. Oh, that's, um, yeah, no. Nah. I do feel pretty bad. definitely in the trees though. Yeah, he was right down there. How'd it hit? Yeah, good. Like, fair old, fair old whack. Yeah. Just, yeah, stopped. Stopped him in his tracks. Like me and my hand and him. Yeah. Yeah, just... get another one. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty confident. I'm not sure if that's the only fish I'm going to see for the whole trip. <laughs> You've cooked it. You've absolutely cooked it. I maintain. It was a good hook set. Oh, I even told you one hook's coming out. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. You, Fun, need to, you need to be clearer on your like if you want me to use them. <laughs> oh, you just, use them. oh, you just. Well, that would have been your first fish, young fishing reel, but don't you f it. Don't get bitter, get better. That's what I <laughs> <laughs> uh, at least I got to see it. Not that's a positive. That was pretty cool. Yeah. Nice colours on it. Yeah, awesome fish. What if I catch the next one? Yeah, it's cool. I get to net it right. <laughs> I'll be pulling it in. <laughs> no, actually, if I if we get another one, if I hook one next, you can land it with your hand. Okay. All right. That's the deal. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And you're allowed to go. <laughs> <laughs> Well team, the morning bite is, I think it's pretty fair to say it's finished, but we're going to have a quick crack for a yellow belly. Um, you would have shortly seen before, we've already had a little crack. I would love to catch a yellow belly. Sean O, just unfortunately the hooks fell out right <laughs> at the death there. Um, <sighs> but look. Who needs mates anyway? Certainly not you. But look, we're all richer for the experience and wiser. So we're going to give it a proper nudge now. Both got vibes on. It's just the vibe of the place. Can we get the, the big dog? I might need a pole. Oh, oh, big cod, big cod. Did it follow you up? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It wasn't big, big, but sorry. That's right. What are you swimming in? Oh, I just turned it. I just have a look at my lure as it's coming up, and I saw the big cod behind it. Yeah, uh, Chuck, you're swimming. You reckon? Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Are you right with that? Or? Yeah, probably. You sit there for a while. Oh, there's loads of fish in it. Oh, oh, there's a yellow. There's a yellow. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
See? Yep. Yep. Where's that school? Oh, right the rock. So it turns out after the yellow belly incident, Sean I was a little bit upset. So much so that he decided to sabotage my audio by dropping my brand new microphone straight into the water. Not heaps, not, not as much as you'd imagine, Sammy. Have a, have a crack, it's just there. See where the flashing light is? Yeah. Yep, you got it, got it. It's fresh water. It is fresh. Got lights on. Turn it off and leave it off for a little bit. Well guys, um, pretty tough morning session. No opportunities on the cod. We saw a little follow, saw a couple more mooching. We did, and when I say we, I hooked a yellow belly. And I uh, got to see it about four or five times. Sammy got to get really close to it four or five times. I touched it. And let like it go. four or five times. <laughs> and let it go. Premature release. Had also another follow from a yellow. Uh, didn't hook it, but we're going to go back, regroup, reassess, recharge. This afternoon. It's going to be on. I got a follow from a cod, so that's pretty cool. I'm just worried that we're going to not catch too many this afternoon that people might start getting concerned. Or if we go back, have a feed at camp, and come back. Yeah. Yeah. Full of energy. Full of energy, full of gusto and gumption. Yep. Cod fishing. Yeah, good. <laughs> Master Chef Whale. Took it up a feed, mate. A quick lunchtime special. Is this a one pan wonder? It surely is, mate. It surely is. Everything's a one pan wonder if you're clever about it. <laughs> Thought I'd give you a quick tour around camp. We've got um, the mobile. Homeless shelter here. Look at that thing, mate. Absolute animal. And then we've got the Taj Mahal in the background. Well, guys, it's lunchtime. Lunchtime fish. We're uh, we're having a crack for yellows. Got him. Yeah, boy. Yes. Oh, that's so good. Oh, cracker. I don't know how big it is, so I've got to go really light because I've got small hooks. On the drop. Yeah? Yeah. That's sick. Oh. Oh, oh Sammy. No. I didn't have to help you with that one. No. Tiny little ZX hooks. Easy to break. <laughs> Probably would have landed that if I had of um had the original hooks on there. Oh, that's pretty disappointing. Yeah, I really would like to have seen that. It seems half reasonable too. Bugger! Well, that was that was a yeah what? He had a fair go. Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, that was fun. How good to catch a fish. Yep, wouldn't be able to tell you today. Bugger. Another one. Just going to take this one nice and easy. Let it sink right down, it's deep. Okay. Come up. Get out of it, Sean. Get out of it. No, seriously. <laughs> I've never fought a fish so light. I'll, I'll, I'll net it for you, Sammy. <laughs> 
Colby made it look like they fought so much easier on the swim bait gear. Guys, it may look like I'm really taking my time on this. I'm not a yellow belly fisherman. This is on a little ZX40, which has tiny little assist hooks. And I just lost one, so... I'm just gonna... Oh, I saw it. I don't know, I just saw a flash. Sean, yeah. are you able to try and grab this? Sure can, mate. I'll try and lift it first. Do you want to try and lift it? You've got four cracks. <laughs> oh. Look, I'm doing this for me, not for you, Sammy. Yes! <laughs> this is what it feels like, Sean. You wouldn't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, 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 I need this, I need this. Pretty cool. Oh, that's sick. That's a cool, that's a good size, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, well, I think it is. For me. Oh, nice. Yeah, thing. it is. It's a nice fish. <clears throat> right. Use your you can use one of those little vibes. Please don't keep, please don't keep. Yes. Ha ha. That's good. Well, there you go, guys. Me first Glenline Yeller. Took a little ZX40, just jigged around some trees. Um, and what makes this so much more special is I've managed to land one before Sean did. Um, yeah, look, he, he tries. <laughs> Put it back up here. He tries to claim that he had one on the... What is that noise? Bird. But yeah, nice little fish. He tries to claim that he almost had one before, but I... I don't believe him. It's a good yellow. It is a good yellow. They go hard. I wish I got a yellow, that's for sure. Well, I came here with the hopes, the, the dreams to get a yellow belly. I crushed. Let's give him a big release. Oh, you got side cam. You, releasey. I'm gonna catch another one. That one ate it on the drop. Really? Yep. So I don't know anything about what I'm doing here, guys. I'm just jigging this little vibe, but um, there seems to be a few around. That one ate it on the drop, the other one followed it out a bit and clunked it. I'm just jigging it on the bottom. Yeah. Got him? Yeah. Yes! Yes, Shauno! Yes! Yes! Don't rush him! Did he? Hang on, I'll just grab the lead. It's a big bony! Did you jag a bony? No, he's eating it in the mouth. Yeah, you definitely ate it. Well, go easy. They go hard. Yeah. Um. Yep. Huh? We're on the same page. Yeah. At what stage do we put a 10-0 through this? <laughs> um, right. Well, yeah, I don't think of. That is a big bony. It is a big bony. He's eaten that. Legitimately eaten that too. Yeah. yeah. I thought I got a hit before from a bony, but I thought, oh, maybe it's just because I put it through the school. But no, nah, that ate it. 
bony champion. Is that your first bony? First bony. I'd never even seen one of these until today, actually. That's and that's good. legitimately eating a vibe. Yeah. That is cod food 101. That's why I suppose we're using those big swim baits. You, you, you look at some of those swim baits, you think they're too big, but that's what's swimming around. The cod are just smashing them, I'd reckon. Oh, imagine live baited. Oh, if you only you could, Sammy. Oh, I wonder if you could. Just like churning, you've got to hold these things upside down. They don't fight it. I feel so bad, we should be live baiting it. Oh well. Off it goes. Oh, he's gonna get walloped. Sean, talk me through it. There it is. I just had a follow, and um, it's a beautiful golden. Oh, he smirked it too. Yeah. I was just slow rolling it back in. Thought I'd just try it different instead of trying to vibe it, I just slow rolled it. Should I net this one? Yeah, if we could, mate. It's not huge. I reckon it's the same one, eh? Yeah. Yeah, it's about the same size. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh, yeah! You probably deserve that one. You probably deserve that one. I'm super stoked. I don't know why I'm whispering. I caught it. Oh, you scoffed it. Yeah, I know, now we've got to get it out. That is an epic fish. No donuts. No You've donuts. avoided the swim. Yes! Yes! Alright, I'm going to release this fella. Oh, straight away. Straight away. Oh, I am so stoked. You won't believe it. It's not the biggest or the best one out there, but it's my biggest. Yellow belly, and I'm so stoked. I came here with just the ambition to get either a good yellow belly or a good cod. I'll take either. I didn't come here to get a good bony brim, but I did tick that box, so good yellow belly though. It's just, yes, I'm still whispering, I don't know why. I just feel like you've got to be quiet when you're out here. Fresh water. <laughs> yeah, you've got to be quiet. Yes. As we cast our way through another epic sunset, it seemed like we were in the wrong spot at the wrong time, and we finished the day without a single cod bite. Righto, early in the morning, super cold, coffee. Really pumped about this morning today, could be the day. You gotta keep telling yourself these fish are one cast away. Sammy, what are we doing mate? We've, we're out really early. We're doing inspirational chats by the sound of it. I know. You set your mind to it, you can achieve anything. You know what? Now, we just left the boat ramp now. It's a last moment, your hands are gonna be warm enough to actually feel, so embrace this. Let's get into it. Embrace each other. <laughs> if you're lucky, mate. Well, good yarn. Let's get into it, right? Yeah, mate. That's, um, that's exciting. No, no, good. How does it is stick coming straight this way? Yeah. Oh, you got him? Yeah. Oh, Sean O. Sean O. Sean O. Sean O's on. Oh, it's big, it's big. Sean is on. And that's it. Yes! 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 yes. I can't see your hands. Sean! You're kidding! You're kidding! I think my leader was nearly on the rod tip and it just went. I thought you were kidding. Oh no, I look, I just wet myself. <laughs> Shorno, Shorno, Shorno. I'm shaking. My legs are like jelly. If you haven't been cod fishing, it's just about the most fun you can have your pants on, there's no doubt about it. That is. I've got to take a second. I can't even look at the fish. It's, it's just all happened so fast. We'll, we'll, we'll have a, a quick look. Yeah! <laughs> oh, yes. That's, that's like a second now. Oh, let's have a look. We'll have a look. Oh, yes. 
That just happened. That just happened. That just happened. Last morning. Oh, straight away. I'm like, I'm like three casts in. Well, that wakes you up, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, that's an 80. That's an 81. 81 and 82. Oh. But that is epic. That yeah. is so epic. Yeah, we'll call him 81. Right, I hold him up. Hold him up. Oh, yes. That is so sick. That is so cool. <laughs> Worth the trip? <laughs> oh, mate. I'll get up in the coal every day if I have to do this. If I get to do this, this is insane. It's a slob. Oh, far out. That is so epic. I'm so stoked. Is he going to give you a big morning shower? Yeah. Probably one of the coolest things that's ever happened in fishing to me. I'll always remember that. That is just sick. Does that wake up better than the coffee? <sighs> that is. I'm good. I'm good. I've just ticked the Murray Cod box. Okay, 81. I'll take it all day long. That's a fish of a lifetime for me. That's so good. I can't believe that. Yes! We did it! We did it! Let's get another one. Let's get another one. It's still in the bite time. With Shawno's fish added to the tally, there was still hope of getting another bite before the sun came up. Halfway through this exact cast, my GoPro ran out of card space and stopped recording. Just seconds later, this happened. So guys, uh, my camera just went dead, which is a bit of a shame because um, this just happened. It's a real one. Um, that's a real one. That was a real one. Literally, my camera went set dead about, oh, I don't oh, know. Cast. 30 seconds beforehand, 30 seconds. It was the same cast. This guy just absolutely belted it. This is gonna go close to it. Oh, this is gonna go in the 90s, easy. That's an absolute belter. Oh. 99. Well, that is 99. <laughs> 99 centimeters of Glenline Dam Cod. It does not get too much cooler than that. Oh, what a morning! What an absolute morning! Oh, what a fish! What a fish! Have we got the head on him? Oh, what a tank! That is so sick. We're gonna get some, give him a drink, and then get some stills. That is a uh, absolute trophy. Oh, I'm so stoked. <sighs> well, there he is. All the casts pay off for a big fish like this. I've kept him in the water. He's in good nick. It's time to let him go. <sighs> Two in the morning. Let's go for three. That's so sick. Unfortunately, cod number three for the morning never eventuated, and it definitely wasn't through lack of cast. In fact, even the yellow belly gave us a silent treatment, so it was time to head back, pack up camp, and hit the road, but not before one more stop. Well, guys, needless to say, the, uh, the morning yellow session, it never really came to fruition. Not a lot of yellows in the boat. Not a lot of yellows, but we had a lot of fun. I thought, what better way to sign off this video than on the um, dirty 30. She's come up a tree, doesn't she? She's I really wish I had thought of something more smart ass. Nah, no, you don't need to, mate. This is, this is, you know, four years in the build, this, this trap. But I'll tell you one thing that was... Anyway, so the fishing was so epic. <laughs> no, no, what I was about to say is this is a pretty special car, but nothing will take away from that cod that I got this morning. Okay, that's a good time. I, good segue. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you were being such a smart ass, you probably would have heard the whole thing. But anyway... I thought you were talking about the Jero for a I, bit. I just... I, really stoked to get that fish i mean i've done a lot of blue water fishing not much fresh water and to get a cod of that size you know, i get it i get why they're so special yeah. get it to the fact that we've already discussed a return venture possibly with the uh the chatter that maybe a metery needs to happen Ooh. sooner or later and the yellows yeah. i'm i'm quietly impressed with the yellows yeah, and the bony beam they're pretty special too but not as more good. so the yellows on my <laughs> end um obviously not being a bony brim chaser slash catcher 
I wouldn't know. No, so I'll, I'll catch come that. back. I just want to get it another cod. Like eighty centimeters, stoked. I, I, to be honest, I don't even need to get bigger, but something now after seeing that ninety-nine centimeter one, wouldn't mind getting a metery. It's just one of those things. It's like because you work so hard to get it, it makes the capture that that's, much sweeter. It's like I, it as I, when I sold this trip to Sean, I was like, mate, you got to come. He's like, yeah, 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 we could. I was like, mate, it's like this. It's the freshwater version of blue marlin fishing. Absolutely hours and hours and hours of yeah. nothingness. A lot of casts. And then just, well, cod don't fight that hard, so it's about 20 seconds of madness. But still, still, it's they the might hit. not fight that hard, but my legs were shaking for a solid oh, yeah. hour after catching an 80 centimetre cod. It just, I was over the moon. And yeah. it's working so hard for it. It's putting up with the cold. It's getting up early. It's all that crap combined. company. Yeah, it's all that dealing with. Oh, Bozo over here for three days straight and then finally getting the fish of a lifetime, yeah. you know. No, nah, it was red hot and, mate, glad you got your cod and didn't have to yeah. go for a swim. He did he did break a PB and I said, if you broke a PB, you have to go for a swim. He's just making rules up again, mate. He refused. So feel free to jump in the comments and say some really choice things about Sean and his, That's all right, mate. his was, lack of gumption. Oh, I, was, I, was, I was so stoked. I just... You know, that was, for me, that's all that mattered. I just wanted to come down here and get a cod. Any cod. I would have been stoked with a 40 centimetre cod. Yep. But um, to get an 80 and I'm, one centimetre. I'm pretty happy to say that revenge has been sought. I was lucky enough to get two, the 82 and the 99. That is revenge enough for me. I feel like the cod, cod gods have looked down on me favourably and just given me the big, good on you for giving it a crack, Sammy. Supplying. And then we got a yellow each. Could have got two each, but you know I dropped for the hooks. So did <laughs> so did Sean. A big hook pull, but mate, great trip. Yeah, good adventures, good, good laughs. And uh, if you guys do get down here anytime soon, make sure you come and check out the cod that are breeding on the other side of this wall here. We're at the dam wall at the moment. You can just see these monstrous cod well, um, protecting their nests and doing their rounds. I'll you show you some drone footage, some cool drone footage after this. Um, but yeah, it's definitely worth checking out. The dam must visit. Um, Cod, get around it. Red hot. We'll be back. trip Sean and I both had an absolute ball now I was gonna do a bit of a tackle talk but then I realized it was exactly the same as what we talked about last week with Lubin and Colby so if you do want to find out a bit more info about how to chase cod make sure you go back to last week's video and check that out if you'd like to support my channel make sure you jump on my website www.sammyhitskyfishing.com uh, grab yourself a hat grab yourself a key ring there's plenty of other cool stuff on there so make sure you go check it out if you liked or learned something from this video Make sure you hit that like button and leave us a comment below. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe because there's plenty more fishing action to come every single week. Well, guys, I think it's back to salt water for me next week, so you'll have to stay tuned and see what I'm chasing. So, hope you stay safe, hope you stay well, hope you're getting a few fish for yourself, and I'll catch you next week for another Sammy Hitsky fishing adventure. Cheers, guys.